Hey, yo, 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 what is up, chat? Deeper Depths here with the Deeper Level, and I am back at you with another video regarding Final Fantasy 16. Listen, I have found what I feel is the best way to gain experience, gill, and also ability points early on in the game. You do not want to pass this up. But before we jump into that, make sure you like and subscribe to this channel. Also, hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I go live and more content becomes available right here well without further ado let's jump right into this video so as you can see i have a description or a picture pulled up of the local map which is the hideaway now this is in act two after that uh the hideaway spot has changed of course in the storyline five years have passed uh but it'll basically seem like it happened in a day so once you get to the new hideaway spot as you can see, I have it marked on the map with a marker. You want to visit the Art Stone. Now, if you are not playing this game uh, with the Aret Stone or Art Stone, I'm gonna just call it the Art Stone because I don't want to butcher the name. <laughs> if you are not using the Art Stone in this game, you are playing this game all the way wrong. Again, I did not want to rush through the Final Fantasy experience and only do the storyline missions. A lot of people play their games that way. That's fine. Some people say, well, I'll gain experience as I go. But me personally, I like to go into each fight with a buffer and I want to know I've got the max gear and the max skills that I could be using at that level. So this is the absolute best way. If you have not been using this thing, make sure you use it. OK, so once you have actually uh, gotten to the art stone uh, in the hideaway in the new spot there is a level that you're looking for and you want to select uh, you want to go over here down to stage replay and scroll all the way over to this cost nice you want to replay this stage as many times as you can if you skip through the cutscenes, I promise you, it will not take you long to do it at all. And you can finish this mission in about two to three minutes tops. I promise you, if you've got the right spells equipped, you actually can do it quicker than that. What you're trying to do is you're wanting to kill this Republican War Panther because you're going to get 168 experience every time that you kill it. You're gonna get 36 ability points every time that you win and also 600 gil. That is huge. Again, 168 experience, 36 ability points, and 600 gil every time you kill it. And you can do this anywhere between two and three minutes as far as the amount of time that it takes to complete the mission. So on a worst case scenario basis, if it was taking you three minutes to complete this mission, that would mean you would be gaining 3,920 experience per hour, 720 ability points, and 15,000 gil per hour. This is the absolute best way to farm on this game. So again, if you are not using the art stone, I promise you, you are not playing this game the way that it was created to be played. Also, something I do want to mention is there are two items that's going to make sure that you are getting the max experience and the max gill. You want to be running the Kate Sith Charm Accessory. Now, this was part of the pre-order bonus with the game, which increases gill earned by 25%. And then you need to be rocking the Scholar Spectacles, which increases the amount of experience earned by 10%. Now, again, I don't use these when I'm actually playing the game itself through the storyline because there are way more powerful accessories that you don't want to take up those slots by using these. But for the purpose of farming, this is what you want to be using. Now, in the event that you do not have those items, you will still be gaining 3,360 experience per hour and 12,000 gil per hour. I think that is still incredible, but if you have these items and accessories as the pre-order bonus, you definitely want to be using those. Well, anyway, let me know your thoughts and comments below if you're playing the game, where you are in the game, uh, how it's going for you, just what you think about Final Fantasy 16 as a whole. This is Deeper Depths, and I'm signing out with the Deeper Level, and I will see you again on the next video. Peace. Let's get it. Pull up to the spot.
Butterfly plays Captain Bennett Fucking red carpet Falls the scene Like a TV or show Stopping for a And when we hit the club You know it's bottle popping We know how to celebrate We know how to celebrate